So everybody, first of all, greetings to all of you. A very good evening. I am Pavni. I am the PR manager at Easy Schooling, and the topic for today's session is rethinking education for the twenty-first century. So, for all of us, the most important requirement I was mentioning was apart from infra, most important is the platform and how you train your teachers to use that. and after that give freedom to child let him explore at his own will and let him develop skills and when they do the assessments when the ai driven assessments they come mm. it clearly points out where they have gone wrong and what they need to and then as per the error list generated when we customize the assignments based on the gray areas what will happen their weakness becomes the strength so that is what ideal guru has to do now we don't have ideal gurus gurukula system so at least we should have the ideal uh, guru in the form of a platform where the platform talks about enriching knowledge taking care of their exams talks about exploration talks about everything even if i want to experiment through a simulation or maybe to a da a do it yourself experiment and in the era of information technology uh, need of the r is that our students should be trained for self learning so that they know how to become independent learners we here we are using technology also because uh, all our green boards have been replaced by interactive panels so the same content of the question banks even the ncert textbooks the highlighted ncert textbooks are also projected in the classroom and then interaction is uh, carried out and for testing the comprehension skills the teachers ask questions from the students and this helps the students to teach in an interactive manner where she can take up the role of a like you can say facilitator we have this uh, three things which we normally focus on i say do the pre reading i'm going to teach this lesson tomorrow so pre reading pay attention in the class 100% attention in the class and finally it's a post reading and weekend it's a revision of everything whatever you have done this is the mantra which i have given to my student so you can do wonders but the, and tell the parents there is no need for your child to go anywhere because we have the best teachers so how can we empower the teacher using technology and it's the teacher's choice because again the teacher would know how to teach the students better than anyone else so if you empower them with multiple different artifacts and the entire youtube is out there entire internet is out there so they can actually make it into a compact plan which they feel that their students will resonate and understand and then engage them in the classroom that is very very important so i think a blended approach would be the right way to push the students in this generation Hmm. we will have to entirely change the way in which we are teaching it should be more uh, you know more of conceptual uh, based yes rather than just giving them information which they already uh, they can access it we will have to tell them why and how that information can be used right information is no endless and we need to curate and uh, people like siddharth is uh, rightly you know providing us that kind of a platform where i think we can provide the uh, right kind of content to the uh, students at the right time and that will bring right outcome you know to our uh, generations and uh, i hope that uh, this kind of <clears throat> uh, affordable and quality content um, you know uh, should reach you know to each and everyone i think technology is neither good nor bad it depends on us how we use that and the use of technology nowadays it cannot be underestimated see in uh, i think knowledge doubles in every 10 years and abundant knowledge is available now on social medias and everywhere but the thing is that that is only information and with the help of that information transformation should take place then that education is said to be useful otherwise it is useless